Good morning, everyone. I hope you're all doing well. This is David Hoffman from David's Bin here, coming at you from Lauder Hill, Florida, yes. with my girl Nina Unrated. Hey guys, you're back. Yes, I'm back. I'm excited. Today we're gonna be having Trinidadian breakfast. Yeah, we're here at Joy's Roadie Delight. Delight. Yes, right? yes. Since yes. '92, this place makes authentic Trinidadian breakfast. I'm excited. They have a variety of food, but the breakfast is what I'm here for. Yes. You know, first what? time for me. First time. Yes, I'm excited. Okay, you so ready to go? I just got back from Trinidad. <laughs> I'm gonna have some doubles and some pies. Let's yes. go inside. It's my first time, so I'm looking forward for this. You want to yeah. go in? Got it? Yeah, I got it, I got it. My man, how you doing? Wonderful. Everything Welcome. good? Yes, definitely. I'm sorry, what's your name again? Pradeep. Pradeep, Pradeep. Yeah. Hi. This Hi. is Nina. How are you? Hi, Nina. Hi. Hey, how you I'm doing? <laughs> Nina, nice yeah. to meet you. <laughs> so we're going to go in the back and see how you guys make doubles. Yeah. Doubles? So doubles is, is like, it's almost like chole batore. Almost that like Indian style. It's a bara. Okay. I'll show you right now. Okay. All right, let's go. That's it right there. That's the yes, bara. Yes. This is the best. Look at that. So if you guys don't know what this is, this wow. is bara. These are basically, um, you know, dough that's rolled out, flattened, and they throw it in the fryer. It takes five seconds. That's it. Five seconds. My last day in Trinidad, I did uh, four doubles and one triple. So we have all the chutneys. You guys have uh, peppers. Lots of pepper, right? Oh, it's the best. Super, super spicy. Oh, she's doing pilori right here, right? Yeah, so if you guys don't know what pilori is, that's chickpea with flour um, ball, right? It's like almost like a donut, but it's savory. It's not, uh, there's no sweetness to it, right? And right here, you know, they're making like a million of them, right? So they just keep going. So it fries up, takes about two or three minutes, flips them out, moves them all in, right? And then there's more of this, oh, so there's the alu pie. Okay, so right here we have the alu pie. How you doing? You love it, right? Yes, I'm excited. It smells amazing back here. Everything looks fluffy and fresh. I'm ready to go. Looks good. Looks mm -hmm. good. Mango, tamarind, and apple. Also in it, green apples. I have the pepper and the cucumber. And I bring some tamarind chutney also. So are any of these spicy or no? It's spicy. That's spicy. Yeah. So this is a spicy one. You can see, I mean, there's a lot of like chili flakes inside, right? Some seeds in there. And the other one's a mix. So that's mango, apple, and tamarind. So that's gonna be a lot sweeter, right? Tamarind's super sweet. So these apple pies are almost ready. See, they're golden brown, beautiful. That's exactly how you want them. And so how do you guys do it? Do you open it up and fill it up with chana and all the chutneys as well? Yes. Yes, okay. So traditional, as authentic as it gets. That looks so good. Amigo, ¿cuánto lo hacen al día de estos? Porque lo hacen todo el día. Or uh, como tres veces al día lo hacen. Todo veces al día. So two times a day they do this. Aquí hay por lo menos 100 o más. No? No? Más? Más. So over 200. So he's from Guatemala. She's from El Salvador. So we're talking about Central America here. Me voy a Nicaragua la próxima semana. <laughs> These guys, <laughs> they're just too focused right now. <laughs> yeah, so what I love about Bada is that they're so fluffy and you eat them in two bites. You're supposed to do it in two bites. I'll show you how to eat this. Okay. This is the best. So you can have, you know, a double, triple, a quad, however you want it, you know? But usually it's just chana, chutney, and that's it. So ch chickpeas, chana. Aquí. So as you guys know, I was recently in Trinidad and there, the way it works is a little differently. People do like bara factories, like at three in the morning, from 3 a.m. to 6 a.m. They just make millions of these, right? And then they put them in the coolers just like this and they take them out to the vendors and then the vendors buy from them and they sell it to the people. So it's a little different, right? But same procedure here, it's fresh daily. They make it three, four times a day. So whenever you come, you get it fresh. We're doing it for breakfast. It's already like 9.30 in the morning. I can't wait. This is going to be so good. Boom. Listo. So these are the pilories. Yes. Savory donuts. They are amazing. This with the chutneys and the roasted pepper. By the way, Nina hasn't tried the spice level of Trinidad. Trinidad is real hot. They, you guys have uh, one of the hottest peppers in the world, from my understanding. Yes. Yeah. I didn't go that far down. I think it's south, uh, southeast is where they have the plantations, right? But this is going to be so good. Oh, I can't wait to eat. The scorpion. Yeah, the scorpion pepper. Sorry. Sorry about that. So let me let me try this. Let me try this. Look at this, guys. Woo! Oh, they're hot. They're hot. All right. So the pilories are ready. So the way it works, pick them up, let the oil drip out a little bit, 
you know, drain it. You don't want it to be too oily. Let's give it a second and then straight in. Wow, this is so hot right now. Ooh, that's the perfect color, right? Golden brown. It has to be golden brown. They're so fluffy. They're so good. Oh, I cannot wait to eat. That's heavy, huh? No. No? <laughs> Thought she was struggling there. We get accustomed. I know, I know. It's a tree anyway, you know? Perfect. And right here, guys, we have dal puri. So lentils, puri. Yeah, it's a good piece. Oh wow, this is a nice flattener. It's a huge one, huh? I did a 22 incher in Southern Trinidad. So right now she's doing the dal puri, so it's split peas with bread. It's a big, it's almost like a huge parata, really. It's less of a puri, more of a parata style. Massive, massive roti. Nice, so you just flatten it and then you put it in the presser, right? This is a pressing machine. Oh wow. Funny is that it doesn't really have puri properties. Like puri is different, you know. Puri is almost like butter. That's puri. Yeah, she folds it. Beautiful. And that's how we have the da puri. So the difference between a, a da puri and like a roti is the roti is already stuffed. You stuff it. This is just you yeah. just the layers and of uh, dough. The meat and, it, and the potatoes and then you wrap it. Exactly. Okay. Got it. Got it. And then right here he's gonna do just the parata. Look at that. That's a lot of oil. It's incredible. <laughs> Looks like a gas station here. <laughs> gas station oil, oh, that's amazing. All right, wow, that's a lot of oil. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. So it just slabs on a bunch of oil. Beautiful, look how nice it is, all that dough. So this is a regular parata. Mm -hmm. It's like a 22 inch parata right here. India is not like this, that you guys use different techniques and different uh, tools. So I think we're almost ready. We have the barata, we have the dabpuri, we have the doubles, we have pies, and we have pilori. And a lot of this is mainly plant-based. No, I didn't know that, so that's neat, yeah. Yeah, it's all vegetarian, but they also have meat if you want to add it to the doubles, to the pies, and obviously to the breads. You can feel it. Yeah, they feel that. Oh yeah, fluffy. Oh, reminds me of a South Indian parota. So which is this one? Not a puri. No, that's a puri. Look at how, it's like a pillow. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh! Oh my gosh. The steam hit me in the face. It, it made me hot so quick. And right here we have a traditional doubles. You want the triple, right? Yeah, so I show her what it's about, you know? Taco? Mi gente, gracias. Okay. Lo vemos después, okay? My friend, cuídese. Vaya para El Salvador. Seguro. Okay, we're ready. All right, we're ready to eat? I am so impressed. I'm so, yes, I am starving. I'm ready. Let's get this. Let's go. I right, know. No, it's going to be good. It's going to be good. Hey, thank you so much. Thank you. You're the best. Thank you. We're going to be eating outside. It's going to be amazing. So many good things. I'm ready. Oh, so he's got the doubles and the triple here and the solos. All right, we're gonna eat a lot of food today, but we're gonna start off with the most traditional dish in yes. Trinidad, doubles. Yes. You ready? I, yes, I'm so ready. All right, so I got a triple. The smell is amazing. Yours is spicy though, right? Yeah, so it usually comes with a few different chutneys and pepper. I got the pepper, of course. Look at that. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Nice so and soft. Fluff. Yeah, I'm excited. Let's try this. Oh so God. mine's a triple. So I got three, right? Three baras. Why I got three was because I want to show you a difference, right? So okay. in the beginning, it was usually one, and they had the chana, right. the chutneys, and then people were like, no, let me get double. Like, give me two baras. And then that concept just came out. You so know? now it's called doubles no matter what. Now it's doubles. Instead okay. of just being bara and chana, you know, right. chana. So the way you do it is like this. Like, literally, you grab this. 
Okay. And you pick it up like that. And you're gonna bite right into it. And, yeah, and so you should do like this, and you should bite twice. Yeah, yeah. so I'll show you how it's done. Yeah, so we have the see. cucumber, I have the pepper, so this is gonna be spicy. So it's two bites, right? You can actually do it in two bites? Mm hmm. Really? Mm hmm. It's like I'm in Trinidad. Wow. Oh man, that's some wow. hot. It's like roasted pepper. Oh, you're just spicy. Mine's is delicious. No Mine's spice spicy. over here. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Go with less spice. <laughs> this is hot. But yeah, so that this was one so bite. This is so fluffy. I know, super fluffy, and right? Flaky. Yes. Mm -hmm. So this and this, moist. <laughs> yeah, I mean it's everything, right? It's the perfect combination. Savory. Mm. If you want more sweet, just add some more tamarind chutney. Ooh, and it has so it's mango and tamarind with apple. That's a, that's a very unique chutney. And then watch this. One more bite. Oh shoot! Yeah, you're a pro. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try. Wait. Mm. It's so good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Está bueno. Está bueno. That's hitting. I know. I know. It is mm. hitting the spot. So in Trinidad, they usually do this in the mornings, right? I mean, they're all day. So this is breakfast. It's. I mean. You can have them for breakfast because okay. they're out there at six in the morning. Right. So, like, so it is a breakfast item, but it's also an all-day item. And I love the fact that you have that, you know, plant-based option. Mm -hmm. Like I never knew that with them. Oh yeah, they're very veg culture, mm -hmm. but then they also have, of course, yeah, they have all yeah. the curries. That dude, I ate armadillo. The tattoo. It's called tattoo. Mm -hmm. It's armadillo. Craziest curry of my life. Had iguana curry, and really? there, there it's curry Wait, iguana, what does it taste right? Like? Yeah. Yeah. Is it good? It's so good. Yeah? It's so good. Yeah, I did it in uh, the Coral River. Okay. Oh my gosh. Like in a river yeah. in the middle of nowhere. It's like an hour drive from Port of Spain. Oh, I know. And then I go in for the next one. So I got a triple that I want to show you. I mean, I don't have to eat the whole thing, but you go like this, right? Just pick it up. It's literally like a super soft taco. Yes, go ahead. Oh, I can do this spice Is all day. Is it right? Yes. Mm -hmm. If you haven't tried mm -hmm. this, go mm -hmm. out of your way and come here because you just wow. got to see how fresh they make this. This is every day. Mm -hmm. That's the best part, because some places, it'll be like if you have it at four in the afternoon and they didn't make it fresh, it's gonna be bad. It's like a home cooked meal. Mm -hmm. With grandma in the back really making you that good feel. Yeah, you gonna feel good. Mm -hmm. Dude, this is amazing. This is amazing. This is amazing. Thank you guys. This is so good. Mm. A little over 30 years of practice. Masters. 92. Exactly 30 years. Masters. Oh. Mm. Wow. It's hot. Oh my god, this is hot. Okay. Yours is hot. It's hot. Mm -hmm. When licking your hands is allowed. Love it. Can we try these? Oh yeah, yeah. So these are solos. So this is what you have to pair the doubles always with. This is like the drink of Trinidad. Especially that one. So it's like, you know how you always pair burgers and fries mm -hmm. and a Coke? Mm -hmm. This is that pair. This is the pair. Okay, this is the pair. Wow. Ready? I'm hot. Cheers. <laughs> I'm hot. It's spicy. Oh, this nice is actually one. good. I know it's good. It's good, right? Yeah. Because it's sparkling, right? So it has like a little bit is of gas. Is that banana flavored? Yeah, so it's banana and that's a uh, cola, cola champagne. champagne. Yeah, so it's more of a sherry, right? Yeah. Like a cherry? This is good. Ooh, ooh, dude. <laughs> I'm hot. But here we have some more food, right? So this is the Pilori's. Oh, yes. This is what we... Oh, my God, yes. We're just having some good food, man. The best ever. That's how you eat it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's how they do it in Trinidad, right? They eat it straight in the car. So you, you just pull up in your car, get the double, get the pie, in the car, eat. Bon appetit. Enjoy. Alright, All right, let's eat. Yeah. Too much food. I'm ready. Oh my gosh. This is too much. So what do we have? We have the alu pies over here. Paratha, polori, curry gourd, curry shrimp, tomatoes, choka, baigan choka, which is eggplant, pumpkin, curry potato, and green beans. Green curry beans. green beans. Curry conch and a dal puri roti. Apple J. I'm gonna tell you, the curry conch. Curry conch, it's one of the best things on planet Earth. That snail, you have no idea. Nothing like they do in Bahamas. The Bahamas, they fry it, this is better. Sorry, Bahamas. I thought this was gonna be breakfast. This is like a, a crazy. This is a brunch. <laughs> this is a brunch, this is a brunch, exactly. Right here, we have the parada, right? Yes. Look how beautiful it says. Nice Perfectly and flaky. flaky mm -hmm. Soft, moist. So the way we do it, just break off pieces, right? And dip. So if you want, grab a piece. Just whatever you want, just rip, right? Stop, man. And then from here, I'll serve you okay. some conch. Yes. This is what we need, right? I love conch, actually. Oh, conch yes, is I the do. best. It is so good. You guys don't know what conch is? Basically like a snail, right? Yes, it's 
from the ocean. It's a pretty big one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in, uh, in Trinidad, I bought my daughters huge conch shells. Huge. Yes. And it was you like, can still hear the five ocean bucks. In them, right? Amazing. Can you still yeah, hear the ocean? Yeah, you could. Yeah. They, they say there's a reason for that in terms of like the waves keep headed so many years, supposedly. It locked that the it locks the sound in. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I like it. I like it. I like it too. Are you ready? ready? Yeah, let's okay. do this. Oh this is so good. Listo. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. <laughs> mm. Oh, it's so good. Love the texture. Nice and tender. Mm. Mm, that curry. The flavor. It's yeah, it's not, not too spicy. Mm -hmm. And what's awesome about the barata is it soaks up that curry. You got, if you use a spoon, I get it, but you need to soak up all that gravy with this bread. Mm -hmm. And if you want more gravy, there's more in there. Just dip and go. Mm. 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 Okay. Mm. What a meal. And this is breakfast, but it's also lunch and dinner. Whatever you, you can eat all this whenever you want. So good, right? I know, I'm so happy. I'm so happy too. This is feel good food. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm Right? And you can eat it anywhere. Anywhere. We literally just saw a guy eating it in his car. Just it's amazing. And he made no mess. No mess. That's how you know the professional. Yeah, and it's, you know what's crazy is that I've been born and raised in Miami. First time in Trinidad was a week ago. And we have oh, a- Oh, really? And it's only a four hour flight. It's right there. Wait, what? Really? Mm -hmm. Crazy, right? Only I know you had a lot of fun. I love it. I know. I love it. Oh uh, yeah, right? Like that. Nice and flaky. Beautiful. You master this. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I think India has taught me a lot, right? This is the Apple J. Mm -hmm. Apple First J. time trying this. I'm brand new to this. Mm -hmm. Have you had this before? I tried it. Oh, you have, yeah. right? Okay. I tried all of them there. Yeah, because every time you eat a double, they'll give you one of these. I mean, if you want. Oh, I like this. Mmm. It's very nice. light on the um, bubbles. It's like a clean taste. Mmm. -hmm. Oh, so good. Very refreshing. That's the best part about all these drinks. They refresh you in that heat because yes. it is hot in Trinidad. And so, what do you want next? Shrimp? Are you going to, yes, let's try the shrimp. All right, so right here we have the curry shrimp. It's almost like, uh, it reminds me of like one of these Spanish dishes, like almost like garlic shrimp, right? You eat it differently, right? You eat it okay. with the parada. That. Mm-hmm. Just like that, right? Oh, yeah. Soak up nice curry. Mmm. Mmm. No. Mm. This is amazing. Mm -hmm. Is this considered the, like, in my culture, the rice is the main thing? Yeah. This is their main thing. Bread. Yeah, bread way more than rice. Of course, they have rice. Right. They have, they have, like, uh, pilau. Uh, yeah. Pilau. Yeah, you guys say it a little differently, but it's, it's, it's Similar to the Indian style, right? I'm just gonna like drown it in this curry. Yes. You loving it, huh? Yeah. We have so much to taste. Mm -hmm. I'm afraid we're getting full. And I'm trying to taste everything on this plate. Mm -hmm. well, no. But I am gonna have the shrimp. Mm -hmm. It should be so good. I'm kind of right. cheating. I'm doing the a mixture. No, it's good. It's good. Yeah, mix the calm, mix the shrimp. You know, I like the curries, how light they are. They're more like, uh, like more liquidy, not too thick gravy, you know? Mm -hmm. Mmm, and not too spicy either. Obviously, if you want spice, still add it. They have a lot of pepper. Yeah, so like what I do is I open it up so you can see how fluffy it is, right? Okay. Remember, this is not potato. This is straight flour, right? All-purpose flour. Is it spicy? No, that is the mango tamarind, right? Mm -hmm. That's the tamarind. Oh, so this is tamarind. So this is going to be super sweet. Okay. Think of like all the Indian food we've eaten together. Yes. It's very similar, right? So they, and they have a lot of tamarind down in Trinidad. Mmm. Mm-hmm. 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 I'm gonna go braver though. I'm gonna go brave. Uh oh. You think it's too hot? I'm thinking it's hot. Mm. Is it? <coughs> yeah. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> it's like it's murder. Because okay. the thing is they roast these peppers. Wait, let me so taste they get even it. hotter. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna taste it. Wait, just taste it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. Should be. Tea. Ooh. It gets to you. Like, mm -hmm. I feel it in my head. I start sweating, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Trinidad is hot. It's Ooh. hot. It's hot in Trinidad. And that was just a little thing. No, this creeps up on you. It does creep up on you. And you feel it here, and your saliva <laughs> just starts coming out like of, of everywhere. That's mango and apple. Mm. Oh, yes. Let's try that. Ready? Mm hmm. Mm. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It's the mix, right? So you get the mango and 
the tamarind together. That is really good. This is my first time having that. Mmm, so good. It's my first time having this. Oh yeah? Yeah. Yeah, this is uh, very similar to like a, in India, like a bonda. Who mm -hmm. likes spice? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, it's good. Great contrast, you know? Spicy, sweet, and savory. Mm. That was amazing. It's amazing. The goat? The goat. We should do the goat. Okay, goat? I'm the goat. Yes, you yeah. are the goat. <laughs> Look at that. I'm excited. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give you some. Here you go. And I think for this one, we're gonna do the dapuri, right? Okay. So same thing, right? And look, so the inside, you can see, you see the split peas, right? Right there. So it's like lentils, right? Beautiful. Yep. So, so you just grab. Yeah, you just grab a piece, go. right? Same thing, just grab a piece. And then with this, we go in here. Oh, it's gonna be great curry go. And this one, as you can see, the gravy is a little more brown, right? Yes. Usually it's how it is with like a darker meat. Yeah. Ready? Mm -hmm. Nice and tender. Mm. Right? Has a smoky taste to it too. For me? Mm -hmm. Go and lamb, the best meat on planet. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Go and lamb. You know when best. I discovered um go um first time I had go was at a Haitian restaurant. Oh yeah, of course. Congratulations, like the food is amazing. It's so good. Wow. Mmm. Yeah, I gotta try this food. Mm-hmm. What do you think of that pudding? Good bread, right? I like I love I love all of it. Mm-hmm. And it's, you have more respect for the food when you see how it's made. Mm -hmm. Of course. Because you just see these little round balls and you're like, yeah, great, but the way they're made, wow, mastery. Yeah. I, I just love watching it being made. I mean, I start salivating watching, yeah. you know, it's, it's amazing. And you get ready for eating. You get ready. Okay, so lastly, we have the three sides, right? The chocas. So three of them are chocas. The other one's like a pumpkin mash. This one is a potato, like, I'd say like potato curry. Yeah. You know? Very similar. And then you have tomato choca. So Eggplant is, choca. Mm -hmm. So it's basically just roasted, right? Yes. So over fire, that's why it's gonna be smoky. I'm and we have the, both breads. I'm gonna try the flaky one. Look at this. Perfect. Yeah, Ooh, yes. Uh, Ooh, it's this hot. is the one that got beat up. When did you wanna try oh, first? Oh, I'm doing eggplant, of course. Okay, let's go let's do it. So eggplant, just like that. Yeah, I love how flaky this bread is. Oh, yes. That's a great combo right there. Look at that. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm, mm -hmm. the onions. Mmm, mm -hmm. love the nice. onions. Nice. So smoky. I was mm -hmm. gonna say you could taste the smokiness. Mm -hmm. wow. I was just gonna say that. Ooh, it's spicy. Oh, that riquísimo esto. Yeah, yeah, a little spicy, right? Something. They have a little thing in there. I'm gonna try oh, the yeah. pumpkin next. Mmm, -hmm. mmm. I love it. Sweet. Let me try tomato. Tomato, yeah. Let's try it. And then I'm gonna go to the pumpkin. Okay. These are the different add-ons you can use on any other breads. You can add it onto the pie. Anything. Yeah, whatever you want, yeah. That's the cool thing, because it for them, everything is edible. Yes. So you're allowed to combine, you know? Well, I feel it. Mm -hmm. A little bit of spice. I don't know where I got the spice, but yeah, I one think of them gave me spice. Yeah, one of them. Oh, yeah. Let me try this. Eggplant. That was so nice. It's almost like a salsa, that tomato. Let's try the green beans mm -hmm. next. That is green. Nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, green beans, yes. Mm -hmm. You know what's nice about this culture? You can put your fingers in the food, you can connect with it. Not just in the kitchen, but while you're eating it. Mm -hmm. I mean, for me, that's the best way to like, there's two things. The best way to like, eat food with hands, because the connection to it, right? Yeah. We were born with our hands, not, right. not these spoons, right? Right. And then also eating with somebody is the best way to get to know somebody. Yes, and then their culture, you get to know them like literally at the core. Mm -hmm. That's why I think it's so fortunate. You're like literally looking at the whole world. Most people like live and die in their same little spot. The explorer right here. Dora like the Explorer, it. David. Yeah, the explorer. David the Explorer. So guys, how you doing? Good, good. I'm trying Everything good? Potato. You guys were in Trinidad. I was in Trinidad last week, yeah. Uh, uh, it is good, man. It's awesome. Good. Right. A, a trini. So trini, so many trinis. Trini, trini, Love trini you guys. Bone. <laughs> You're in the right place. Best food in Fort Lauderdale. you find right here, Joyce. Perfect. I love it. All right. We love it. We love it. Oh, yeah. we really love it. We're, we're full of joy. <laughs> <laughs> all right, lastly, we have the pies, right? So these are aloo pies. So there you have a variety. I don't know if you guys have it here, but cheese, eggplant, and then aloo is a staple, right? Wow, look at this, like golden brown, and then always hold it like this because obviously it'll open up, right? right? 
This is like a massive, like samosa. Oh wow, look at that. Yeah, it's like spiced potatoes. This is how you're supposed to do, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. And then you can dip it in anything. And oh, then you fill it up. Oh, you know what? You guys have it open here. Yeah. Right there. I mean, you can fill it up with everything. And we also kept the go. So you can mix any flavor you want. Any flavor. Any flavor you want. I mean, they usually add three to five chutneys. Mm -hmm. It really depends on the, you know, the vendor. Oh, really? Because everybody has their own stuff. And then, obviously, this is not going to be bad. We're adding some of that meat. You want some? So this is like a Trinidadian sandwich. In a way. In a way. With in a cheese. Way. So, yeah. Anything. Anything. And then you also have it like they literally fry eggplants. Well, just like this, they yes. fry it and that's it. And then you got the sweetness. So if you want sweet, you know, I didn't add any sweetness. Oh, yeah. Mm. These are good. Yeah, I had some. These are good on the go. Ones. Oh, yeah, on the go. Going. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, with the goat? Great combo. Good call. Mm hmm. Oh yeah, look at that. You have all the potatoes coming out, like stacked with it, right? Like packed. Mmm. I love this. So good. And this is gonna be a little hot now. I'm gonna add a little but bit. But what's great is how you can make it anything that you want to. Mm -hmm. So if you want it super spicy, not everybody has to be spicy. Maybe just one or two bites. Exactly. Sweeter on this bite to cool it off. It makes sense. Mm -hmm. And you know it's crazy. I went to some vendors yeah. that like it's like you have to have it with the spice because they're like known for it. Okay. Like, like super they're, hot. Like super I hot. I could imagine. Oh gosh. Did Too spice hot. ever make you cry? Of course. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not dropping it. It doesn't make me cry so much, it makes my head sweat. Mm -hmm. Like, whole thing. That's why I know it's hot. Mm. All right, I'm getting full. Dessert? All right, lastly, we have the cassava pone. Dessert, a little bit of dessert, some sweet. Yes. I think. Is it sweet? It's definitely sweet. We're gonna find out. This one right Maybe. here, so it's nice and, uh, is it hard? No, it's soft, it's, it's soft. soft. It's dense, but at the same time soft. Yes. Oh, it's, it's gonna be sweet, I'm Cheers. sure. Cheers. Mm -hmm. oh, it's like, um, Bread pudding. Bread pudding. In a way. Make bread pudding. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. I like that. Oh, amazing. Mm. Cassava. Coconut. Coconut. I was going to say coconut. it's like uh, grated coconut inside here too. And then these are like. Korma. 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 Mmm. Okay. Yeah. Sweet as well. Mm -hmm. What's that taste? Ginger. Ginger. I was going to say. Ginger. Yeah, yeah. Remember, huge Indian influence. Nice. They have a lot of the same stuff, right? Nice. Ginger, tamarind. Curry. Curries. Mm -hmm. I love this actually. So good. Mm, gotta try it. I like these. Ah. And that's it. That's we right. did it. We did it. Come visit Joyce. Joyce Roy Delight. 30 years in business. You just have to come here. We can Lauder Hill. Which is like for Lauderdale, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And in the month of October, they get super so busy nice. because of the Caribbean festivals in October. So the week before and the week after, they are slammed. Yeah. And if you guys want so to come here on a Sunday, because Sundays you guys have an even bigger breakfast menu, right? And you guys also have Trini Ch Chinese, from my understanding, yes. right? Yes. So that's another thing they have, Trini Chinese. What was your favorite thing? Uh, I like the curry. Okay. Um, the goat, the shrimp. Okay. The bread. So everything, basically <laughs> everything. I mean, for me, it's the conch and the doubles. Conch and the doubles were the best. Yeah, yeah. conch was good. Yeah. Conch was good. I think all the food was amazing. Yeah, love those pies. Everything here is made with love. You guys can see it in the kitchen. Make sure you come to a place where you can uh, feel like you're eating from, uh, from your home, from your grandma. Yes, yeah, so if you want to eat Trini food in South Florida, come yes. here. It's in Fort Lauderdale. They named the you street must. after this restaurant. Yeah, it's that good. It's, it's that, that good. good, yeah. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, thumbs up. Leave me a comment yes. below. Subscribe to my channel, her channel, and we'll see you in the next trial food adventure. Bye, guys. Woo. Solo. Where's Han? Where's Han solo. at? Where's Han Solo at? <laughs> it's a bad joke. It's a bad joke. It's amazing. Mm -hmm.